I've got two drawers here with me today. One is made out of glass and one is made out of plastic. When we were designing our new Nivea face care range, we asked ourselves which one is the more environmentally friendly material. So answering that question is not that easy. There are a lot of things to consider and that's why at Biosdorf we have chosen life cycle assessments, also called LCA, to look into the environmental impact of our products through every single stage of the product life cycle. We are starting at raw material extraction, production, transport, consumer use, disposal and recycling. We're looking at things like how much energy is being used during production of the jars. How are the jars transported? How far do they travel? And by which mode of transport? And what happens to the packaging at the end of product life? When looking into environmental impact, we are looking into different impact categories. That is greenhouse gases, which go together with climate change potential. We also looked into how much waste has been generated, how much waste water, and what is their impact on the groundwater and soil. What we found was not exactly what we expected. The plastic jar is more environmentally friendly than the glass jar. We were able to reduce the greenhouse gas emissions by 15%, which is a huge saving. And that happened without actually damaging or harming the other environmental impact categories like soil and water. The main reason for this huge saving in greenhouse gas emissions lies actually in the production of the raw material itself, which is that there's far less energy being used to produce plastic that we use rather than the glass. And we could achieve an even greater reduction of greenhouse gas emissions if the consumer chooses to actually recycle the packaging rather than just putting it to the dustbin. So from here on, we're going to use life cycle assessments to identify the hot spots on our products, and that's through our entire product range. And that we will use to work with our research and development to develop more environmentally friendly products and also to work with our packaging suppliers and raw material suppliers to identify what we can do better. This will help us to achieve our sustainability target of making 50% of our sales with products with reduced environmental impact by 2020. So that's a huge achievement we've made from just three little letters. And it's just one more way to show we care.